So here on Mila's serve, there's a lot of uh, good things she's already doing and a lot of things that I want to add and build. So if you see in the beginning here, she has a nice rhythm. The, the rhythm that the arm's going up here is uh, very good. And she gets a nice high toss. And the left arm is fully extended and stays up, which is great. Uh, this part here is uh, very nice. And if you see the power position here, uh, we should probably get her coiling a bit more, so her whole body coiling. I'll work on this with her so she can get her elbow, uh, this right elbow, a little more uh, in line, uh, more perpendicular to the to the baseline. I can explain when I see you next. One of the things I noticed is her racket will drop. See how her racket falls this way? You can see it right here. The racket will go down this way rather than going back uh, like behind her ponytail she wants to kind of cut in with the racket and keep the racket close to her hair and stay supinated with the wrist and not to open the wrist not to pronate and drop the racket uh, directly down this way it's not see how she just kind of like uh, folds her wrist over here uh, rather than using her elbow to make the back scratch uh, that uh, behind her head she goes she just sort of like flops her, her wrist over here. You can see the racket face is pointing straight up here. And you, you, that you typically, you don't get as good acceleration like that when you just flop your wrist down. Uh, so it's something we can just work on cleaning up. What we focus more on in our lesson is this explosion here, getting a good extension. She does a pretty good job of that. Look at the impact here, how she's not fully extended yet, you can see, for example, here, the, uh, the legs are a little bit bent near the impact. And typically, you'd like to see that left leg completely straight, so like straight up, and you'd like to get a straight line up to the ball. And this position here with the arm is also a little bit low through the impact. The impact point is, is up here, and she could be a little more stretched with her right arm there, she does a good job with her head. You see her eyes are up at the looking at the impact. That's great. So that's a positive. Just want to get a little more extension in the lower body. Sometimes it's called triple extension through the ankle, through the knee, and through the hip joint joints. Uh, let's see the landing here. And this is something we we're working on, exploding over the line. So we're trying to get that foot that left foot completely over the line. It's not quite there yet. So a little more this way with the explosion. And we're working on getting a nice hip extension backwards. So getting this hip to go backwards. And sometimes players will kick it up, up high, higher than their waist or even higher than their shoulders with some professional players. Uh, but, you know, there's a lot of good things here for her age. She's doing a great job. And we just want to try to clean this up to develop more of a world-class serve as best we can um, you know, in the younger years, by the time she's 10 or 11, we'd like to have a, a professional looking uh, serve technique. Good job, Mila.